Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, Girl Thrifted. Jasmine here, happy day, whatever time it is that you are watching. Today I wanted to share a bunch of different ways on how I would wear clogs and socks. Now, I have not always been a socks under sandals person, but I would say the past few years I've gotten really into it. So I'm gonna just show you a bunch of different ways how I would wear my clogs with my socks. This is the first way. Um, I also wanted to remind you, you're going to be seeing a lot of the same pieces mixed and matched. That's kind of the purpose of my channel to show you how many different options you have in your closet that you might not think you have. Uh, so yeah, here's my first look. These Madewell pants, my treasured Paloma wool sweater, look, Le Bon Shop socks, and Sangrin's clogs. Clogs are comfortable, especially these Sangrin's clogs. And Sangrin's clogs. These clogs are so comfortable, I could wear them all day. And they're even more comfortable with socks underneath. Plus it gives it kind of a cute pop of color and helps to balance out the ankle length of these pants with what's going on on the bottom. What's next? Let's see. Okay, so I didn't switch up very much, just my style of pants. Obviously, these are a different pair of pants. But I, again, just want to show you how you can get a completely different look that feels different and new, just switching one piece out. I kept the clogs and the socks and the sweater and switched it out for these Carlene wide legs that I love. I'm going to do a video on them sometime soon. This is a great look. Here's a slightly different look, a different pair of clogs with socks, and my treasured Rudy Jude jeans, and this Jamie and the Jones sweater that I haven't introduced to this channel yet, but I wear a lot. I love the monochrome look with the pop of the green. Let's see if I can accessorize it a little bit. Okay, for just an easy way to get ready to be out in the world, I threw on my James Street Co. hat, and my quilted coat that I love to wear with these pants. I just love the boldness of the colors with the stark white of the pants. Ready for something. Okay, this feels a little holiday and the holidays are behind us or they're in front of us, whichever way you look at it. But I still think it's still winter and I still think I would wear this to like a fun co-workers get together or casual outdoor evening hang, casual fancy. It's got this cute little tie right here. The polka dot sheer socks really dress up the clogs. I feel ready to party. All the parties, bring them on. Oh, these are green Jenny Kane corduroys, by the way. Um, I don't think I've shared them here yet, but I love these pants. Back with my last look of today. Put back on the wide leg jeans because I really love wearing the heels. I feel very tall. And maybe that's something that we could talk about someday is how to feel a little bit taller than you actually are. As you know, I'm 5'2", so I'm, I'm pretty short. <laughs> but I feel leggy, which is not normal. Uh, so a little bit of a heel, the socks peeking out. And this Atelier Delphine blouse, which is kind of a thick cotton gauze, and I feel ready for spring. Though it's not really here yet, I am ready for it. Thank you so much again for tuning in today. I'm Jasmine. This is Girl Thrifted. Please subscribe if you're so inclined, and I'll be back another day to show you how you can get the most of your closet with the pieces that you already own. Thanks. See you soon.